In this video, we will learn how to configure gamification. Gamification is based on our Rules Engine feature, which allows you to define rules for when points and badges should be awarded to users. We have a separate video on the Rules Engine, so make sure to watch it. Gamification allows you to create games where users can earn points and badges by doing certain tasks, advance through levels as they gain points, and optionally see a leaderboard to introduce a fun competitive spirit. Currently we have support for site-wide and course-wide games. Site-wide games allow users to earn points and badges while completing different actions on the entire site, while class-wide games are limited to completion actions within a class. Now let's see how a game looks. You can see the game progress on the homepage dashboard or in the case of a course, on the course landing page. The leaderboard shows the number of points, badges and the user's rank as well as the rank of other users. Users can gather points and badges for completing tasks, such as submitting assessments in different courses, joining a group, completing a learning path, and more. To see a detailed overview of a game, click on the menu icon. Here users can see the full leaderboard and the rules that award points and badges. Now let's see how you can configure gamification. The first step is to go to the admin menu, click App Center, and install gamification. Once the app is installed, you can start creating games. Let's create a course-wide game. Go to a course, Click Admin and select Configure. Under Tabs, enable the Games option. Click the Games tab from the left bar, then click Add. Enter the name and click Save. You will be taken to the overview page of the game. Here you can add a game description. Click Edit, enter the description, then click Save. To add levels for the game, click Add from the Levels section. Enter the name and the number of points needed to complete the level. Then click Save. In the Leaderboard section, you can choose if you want to activate the leaderboard, if you want it to be visible to learners, and more. From the size dropdown, you can select the number of players you want the leaderboard to show on the course landing page. Now we need to define the course rules that will award points and badges for the game. Rules in a course can be added upon enrollment, unenrollment, for modules, sections and assessments. Let's see how to add a rule. Go to a module and select the completion tab. Click add. A pop-up will open with a list of actions. Let's award points. Select the game. Enter the number of points you want to award and if you want to send a canned or a custom message, then click Save. The points that learners earn in the game will help them advance through the levels. You can also add rules that award badges. Click Add. Choose Award Badge. Select the game. Select the badge 
and if you want to send a canned or a custom message. Then click Save. Now let's log in as a learner and go through the game. Learners receive instant notifications when badges and points are awarded for completing certain actions in a course. In this video we learned how to configure gamification and how to create games. To see more features, watch some of the other videos or visit our features page on our website.